Uh, this next one is the more of the traditional style of uh, septic tank, which is concrete rings. They put into the ground. Uh, the pipes run from the toilet into the rings. Um, you add in uh, bacteria into that. There's a big advantage in these in that they do not uh, require any maintenance. There's no pump that can fail. And also, there is no uh, need to empty them. They, they, there's nothing like that required. With the newer type of septic tanks, uh, the plastic ones, uh, at some point you've got to get them emptied uh, and this is, requires a pump truck to come along. Um, it needs careful planning because if you're out in the middle of the country somewhere um, and they're not available then you've got a problem. Um, you don't want overflowing septics and whatever, but that's what you're going to get. And you also have to plan where you're going to put it, the access to the thing with the lorry can get to it. The basic concept of the septic tank is that uh, there's a main tank where your or toilet goes into and then which where is the bacteria is added you just throw into the toilet and then that's overflows into the second one dilutes it and then into a third one or or into a soak away um, some pictures coming up now where you can see how, how the septics overflow into uh, a crushed stone bed so there's no smell coming up from the ground or anything like that and of course there'll be bacteria in there that's overflowed from the septic as well you can see there's a modern one uh, type of uh, thing the only disadvantage i can see in uh, uh, concrete rings is the fact that they use more space in the ground but i suppose if you're on mines outside we've got flowers be build, uh, beds built around it so you can't see the thing 